Hey guys, greetings from the Denaric Valley Bivouac. Today is the scrutineering day and I've got my race number, which is 49. Um, everybody is just going over their bikes. I'm uh, going through the scrutineering, through the technical checks. As you can see, the bivouac is right behind me. As always, the atmosphere here is absolutely insane, but don't take my word for it. See what all the other riders and the organizers had to say. Leonard, this is your first rally ever. How are you feeling? Oh, I'm very excited and I really don't know um, what to expect. Um, of course, I did talk with a lot of people over here. People are great. Um, so I do have an idea uh, how it's going to be on the road, but still, like, um, yeah, if you're riding and you feel this pressure of time, yeah, I think it, it, it's, going, it's going to be awesome, yeah. Are you enjoying the bivouac? Definitely, yeah. Yeah, good people around here. I, I helped them a little bit. Um, yeah, it's nice. So what are you hoping to get out of this? Like, what's your goal? Do you want to just finish it or, or improve your riding or all of those things? Um, yeah, I do want to improve my riding, but finishing uh, for me is the first thing. Uh, I just want to see uh, what a rally is all about uh, and hope to get addicted. Yeah. Okay, now we are in the process of re registration. Uh, which means that uh, we are going through the number of questions, checking out all the details we've been asking you during the registration process on the web, which means your license plate, stuff like that, numbers, security issues, and so um, probably that um, we will end it up to the 6 p.m. After that, the party can start. We'll have some briefing at date, and I already communicate a lot uh, with the people what we are expecting from them, which means to don't underestimate the mountains, to cover, to be fair to the nature, to the cattle, to the local people, and try to enjoy themselves because this is not a race for speed, this is a race for, for beauty. Remind me, please, how many competitors you've got in motorcycle and quad class? I think that we now have a, we all, almost had a 100 competitors before the corona lockdown, which happened uh, three weeks ago. So now we end up with a little bit more than 60. We will have, uh, let's say, 10% quads, 90% of the bikes, and I think that we will have the fair distribution of the small, mid and the big, big bikes. Well, I think that everybody will feel the mountains and feel the, what we are trying to communicate here, which means that the uh, wilderness in the middle of the Euro, Europe. So I think that will be happy. What do you expect to get out of this rally? Um, three days of nice riding with my team. Mm -hmm. Have fun. Let me get this straight. You started riding off-road two months ago and you're here at the rally. Yeah. Tell me more. Yeah, we, we planned vacation to spend in Croatia for quite some time since September and we saw that the, the rally event is here uh, during our vacation time so we said why not? Yeah, Let's he, try it. <laughs> one evening he just asked me, hey, I just found the rally in our setting, so maybe we could ride. So it just looked really scenic, good riding, and you thought, let's go. 